Okay, two more questions, then we'll open it up to the audience. Um, so Ron also asked the audience how many of you have seen The Social Network, and most people have. So I haven't seen it, but I wanted to ask you if, th if that's the picture that, that people have in their head about what happened at Facebook, what's the real difference? What, what is the biggest difference about what actually happened? I mean, where do you want to start? <laughs> One of the biggest ones. I, I mean, I don't know. It's interesting what stuff they focused on getting right. Like, every single shirt and fleece that I had in that movie is actually a shirt or fleece that I own. Um, <laughs> but, um, but I, you know, uh, so there's all this stuff that they got wrong and, and a bunch of random details that they got right. And the thing that I think is actually most thematically interesting that they got wrong is they, I mean, the whole framing of the movie, kind of the way that it starts is, I'm with this girl who doesn't exist in real life, um, who, who dumps me, um, which <laughs> has happened in real life a lot. Um, and, um, and, <laughs> and, and basically they frame it as if the whole reason for making Facebook and building something was because I wanted to get girls or wanted to get into some kind of social institution. Um, and I mean, the, the reality for people who know me is I've actually been dating the same girl since before I started Facebook, so obviously that, that's not a part of it. But I think it's just, it's such a big disconnect from I think the way that people who make movies think about what we do in Silicon Valley, building stuff, right? Like they just can't wrap their head around the idea that someone might build something because they like building things. 